So Jake, I, I'm not a psychologist or a psychiatrist. He's not going to see this video, but it seems that there's a lot of projecting mm -hmm. that he's doing here. Mm -hmm. The projecting is when you do something and you accuse somebody else of doing it. Right. I don't, in fact, I don't know why he takes them down and I don't care, okay? But they, but they found these and so this is December of 2020, okay? So this state secret that apparently that was gonna get blackmailed, etc. Jimmy had already admitted, watch. One time I was in a news studio and I won't say who did this, but someone wore <laughs> such a short, <laughs> no, <laughs> anyway. You gave me a dirty look last week when I mentioned that. I thought it was funny. I'm just saying. I've seen I've seen newscasters naked asses in uh, in newsrooms. That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying who's. <laughs> I think I think it was a nice news skirt. Yes, a nice news skirt. <laughs> <laughs> You know what's interesting? I'm surprised he's playing this because this goes against Anna's version. And that's when they were working for TYT. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So let me get this straight. Hold on. I, I want to see what Jenks says about it. I, yeah. The only thing worse than a nice news skirt is a nice news thong. A news thong. <laughs> <laughs> it's a news bikini. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the news in my news song. <laughs> oh, boy. Glenn. Um, somebody said, uh, Jason said it. This clip they're about to show shows that Jimmy is being consistent in his story. It's such a cell phone by Jenk. That is 100% true. Yeah, that's Jenk, why I said I was surprised he played it. There's a couple problems with that clip. That clip doesn't help you. Number one, that almost certifies to me that Jimmy's versions of the events were true. Yeah. Including the phrase, nice news skirt. Yeah. Anna said that Jimmy didn't say that. As a matter of, uh, unfortunately, we got to play this again. We got to play this again because... Unfortunately, uh, Jimmy yeah, Dore uh, used to work. Unfortunately, indeed, because Jenk, you, uh, you're so lacking in self-awareness. And this is what happens, guys, when you're dishonest. You can't keep all your lies straight, mm -hmm. so you always screw up. Yeah, yeah. So th this is really, really, really bad for them. Uh, to be a pervert show, and there was a written- Okay, here is Anna's version of the events. I mean, related to the show. And as I was walking in with them, that was when he made the comment. Uh, and he didn't make a comment about a news skirt. Uh, he made a comment about how sexy my legs were in front of my students. And okay, he, Anna said he didn't say anything about the news skirt. Mm -hmm. Jimmy said, you mooned me and I said, nice news skirt and I saw your thong. Mm -hmm. That's what he said to us this a couple weeks exactly ago when this story insane. broke out. Then Jenk, you you come on and say, no, he didn't say that. And, and of course, Anna didn't flash him. And of course, he, she wasn't wearing a skirt too small. Of course not. And then she rolls her eyes. He didn't say nice news skirt. He talked about my legs. Well, Jenk, you posted a video where Jimmy was working for your company. This was your right. company. It was a bonus on the TYT show. It had your hashtag. It had all of your markings on it. That's when he was on your guys' show and he made reference to it. How could he have posted this? Literally, who, who, why? Jimmy? Jank. Why did he think that this was going to help him? Because they they didn't they they didn't know. This is a major major the, miscalculation. They did the, that shows almost perfectly that Anna was lying. And, and and you know what's funny? What's funny is Jenk said if Anna would have told me, I would have fired him yep. back then. Yep. We all don't believe that, Jenk. We don't believe you would have fired him because you didn't fire Kyle Kalinske when he yep. was talking about Anna masturbating in front of six thousand people for money. We didn't believe and, you then. We certainly don't believe you now. And you didn't resign from TYT when you made those statements. But Jimmy said this publicly. 
He said it publicly and he laughed about it. You know why he laughed about it? Because you created that kind of environment, Jenk. And it's clear that Jimmy had no inclination at all that this was going to be construed as sexual harassment. Mm-hmm. But the elements were there. The bare bum, the thong, even the phrase, which, by the way... Was word for word. Out of Steph's mouth, not Jimmy's. Yep. That means they talked about it, and he recounted the story to her. I'm, I'm sorry, bro. Yep. I'm sorry. You, this literally turns Anna into a liar. Holy moly. Wow. How 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 could you possibly think that that is that's gonna help you, bro? Your mind has gone to mush. Oh my god. Uh, that's 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 uh that's bad. That's really bad. But this is what happens when you lie. Now I'm gonna come out and say that I think. So guys, Anna, we're gonna do a bonus episode. I'm gonna have to say now. I think Anna lied. I think they were lying. And it's not because of anything Jimmy said or did. It's because of you, Jenk. You just showed us the video from 2020. Mm -hmm. When he was working for your company. Yep. And this is not, this is not something where Jimmy felt ashamed. Right. This is something. And again, he says, I will not mention who it was. Yep. Because two reasons off the top of my head. He didn't want to humiliate her. One is he didn't want to continue and embarrass her. And two, he understood who had the power in the company. This was 2020. Man. Holy moly. That is such a bad look, bro. That's a really bad look. These old videos, because Jimmy does live streams, but he's so unhinged, etc. He takes a lot of them down afterwards, realizing, oh my God, I'm so he takes a lot of them down. That was a TYT owned video, Jenk. <laughs> Terrible things. The only thing worse than a nice news skirt is a nice news thong. A news thong. <laughs> <laughs> it's a news bikini. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the news in my news thong. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, boy. Glenn also pretended that Jimmy was a principled person who was only talking about politics. Have you ever seen Jimmy? He's only talking about politics. I don't know when Glenn ever, Glenn ever said that. And Jimmy's entire shtick is that he's a pothead in his garage. Right. Comedi- he's a comedian. Right. That's what I was going to say. He's a comedian. You're the one saying you're a journalist. Yeah. Jimmy's always self-deprecating. Say, oh, I'm just some pothead comedian. You're the serious journalist, yeah. Jenk. He never made it personal until Anna threatened to reveal this thing that Jimmy had revealed months ago. Be- and why did Jimmy start me? And by the way, hold on, we got We got to correct an error that I made. Jimmy wasn't working with TYT in 2020. He had left a couple years b- before, but this still shows what he said. And Jenk is still full of shit. Well, so, what do you mean? It says TYT on his actual video. Well, yeah, but it, I said this was 2020. Yeah. And it couldn't have been 2020 because he was out of TYT by oh, then. Okay. So I was so just the correcting. The year was wrong. Yeah, my it year was, it could have been 2018 it was or 2019. Still a TYT video. Yeah, but I, you know, that's yeah. why we have yep. people in the audience, right? Because we don't know what the hell we're talking about. We continue. Yeah, so Jimmy broke from them in April of 2019. So that had to be prior to that. And by the way, Jimmy did not break with them over any of this shit. He mm-hmm. broke with them because of uh, Russia Gate. Mm hmm. Talking about Anna when they went into that spiel, okay? Um, And so it was not unclear who he was referring to. It wasn't any random person at TYT, right? They were talking about Anna, and then they say all that. How do you know they're talking about Anna? Anna, Because he didn't say nice news skirt. And he never saw Anna's bum or thong. So why are you saying they're talking about Anna? Good point. That's a good point. Unless you're familiar with the incident and you knew good and well that the showing of the bum and the uh, the the thong was Anna, because otherwise, how would you know he was talking about Anna, Jenk? Because this happened before the Me Too accusation. So what what reason does Jimmy have to lie to make up that story? The Me Too accusation, the, the video is at least two years old, thanks to the members of my audience that, that, that educated us on it. So how do you know he was talking about Anna? He never mentioned her name. 
Jenk, you know what that tells me? That tells me, number one, Jimmy thought it was hilarious. Number two, Jimmy didn't want to name Anna specifically because he really didn't want to embarrass her. And number three, you were familiar with the situation because even though he didn't mention Anna, you knew specifically he was talking about her. That means your support. That, so, so when Anna got on and said, oh, he didn't say nice new skirt. He said something about my sexy legs and you co-signed it. Now we got to call you in a question, bro. That's a fact. That's a fact. I'm sorry, bro. But you you did that to yourself. Unbelievable. The lack of self-awareness here is unbelievable. So... If he's only talking about politics, why is he already trying to humiliate her? And as you see here, again, this is not a long time ago, this is now, and they're having the time of their life. <laughs> like she's doing news. Well, if they wanted to humiliate her, they could have named her. They didn't name her. So there's that. Ah, uh, we're gonna attack her and pretend that she's this and that, and that she's here for our sexual amusement. You people sicken me. Nope. You, you are the person that that made it so that Anna was just there for men's sexual gratification. Let me. Re okay, that's a very nice picture. I know it is. <laughs> what, are you, what are you? Were you going to the prom or something? Like that? I was at a bar. Is that right? I was at a bar when that picture was taken, and um, Jesus is like, "What picture do you want me to use?" I'm like, "Use this one." Because you like it. Yeah. You didn't want to use the red ladies T-shirt that we have. <laughs> <laughs> that we're. <laughs> Everybody check that out on theyoungturks.com, by the way. It's a good picture of Anna and then the red ladies t-shirt. I don't know. I think a little bit. Better. Hey, can you put that up for a second, Dave? Do you have that or no? Okay, so so he couldn't get enough of it. He couldn't get enough of it. So what does he do? Put it up again. Her bar picture right there. Can you pause that and put that up? Look at that. Oh, damn. That is very sexy indeed. Now I'm taking all the time looking at your picture and not enough time for the news alert. So, all right, tell what what is our absurd? So that wasn't even the 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 thing. But he stopped the show to emphasize Anna's sexy gear, and then he went out of his way to say she's so sexy I can't even uh, focus back. Oh, oh, go ahead, Anna. Tell me what you were going to say again. So, no, Jake, you are the guy that does yeah. that to Anna. And by the way, they were talking about Anna when they went into that spiel, okay? Um, How do you know? And so it was not unclear who he was referring to. It wasn't any random person at TYT, right? They were talking about Anna, and then they say all that. So. And you know they're talking about Anna because I'm pretty certain you were aware of the situation. That means when you guys shot your shot, and Anna lying. said he didn't say nice new skirt, but he commented on how sexy her legs were. And then he he proactively went to look up her skirt that you knew that she was lying and that you knew you were lying. That's what it wow. tells me.